What did Brandon Dawkins show you tonight? Well, he showed me the competitor that I always thought he was, and uh, that's one thing about Brandon. I've always said that he's a competitive guy. It's important to him, and probably more important that he even lets on at times. I thought he played well. There's always a few things he liked to have get, uh, back, but uh, he's, uh, you know, he did a nice job tonight and, and uh, bailed us out of a couple situations as well. Do you think that his performance last week kind of brought out that competitive you know, I don't, I don't know. He's always been competitive, but I think he's, you know, he saw that there's so much spotlight on that position, which is natural. I mean, guys that play that position know that, and I think he probably heard it, you know, quite a bit, and, and uh, that's okay. But fueled him, you know, had a good week of practice, and obviously tonight he was, he was really, you could tell he was really serious. I mean, serious, uh, and as far as competitiveness and tonight, and uh, he wanted to keep doing it, put the ball in his hands. Were you able to get a look at the Sean Brown spin move on the punt return for a second? No, down? I didn't. I knew he made somebody, two or three people miss. I mean, he's a talented guy, and, but I didn't. I knew we didn't We didn't have a return on. We had a block on, and uh, he's such a dynamic guy. That was pretty neat. You, you had a lot of freshmen make plays tonight, Colin score at the interception. How, how good is it to see them make big plays yeah, There's like a that? whole bunch of them on yeah. defense. You yeah. know, that first and second units, there's about nine or ten freshmen. And, you know, I, sometimes we hold our breath because they are true freshmen, and, you know, they, uh, you know, everything's going to be a new experience for them. So being on the road is a different environment. You know, we had to bring our own juice, so to speak. And I thought the freshmen played pretty well. What does this do for the morale of the team after a rough loss and now you're heading into that? Yeah, I mean, it's, uh, you know, every win gives you a little bit of confidence. And, you know, this is a game that, you know, on the road that we uh, you know, played pretty well. We played hard. The guys that were on the sidelines were into it. And they know how much uh, bigger and better it's going to get starting next week. But... This is a good one. We can learn a lot from it and get better from it and be ready for Pac-12 play. What started clicking in the second quarter that maybe wasn't clicking in the first quarter? Well, we had a couple drives and there's some things there and they were uh, they did a nice job defensive. We just we didn't I didn't think we played well up front. Uh, I have to watch the film in the first quarter and a half. I didn't you know uh, we didn't I didn't think early in the whole first half we didn't play as well up front. The second half was better. How big of a difference does it make when you're actually coming away with the football at defense like? Oh, the turnovers are so, you know, it's, it's so key for us. You know, not only are we getting turnovers, we're getting turnovers and getting the ball in great field position. And, you know, our offense has been pretty good in, re in the red zone so far this year. But, you know, the, the turnovers and the, the, you know, the special teams play of getting field position is, you know, we got to rely on that. we got a lot of young guys on defense. And, and uh, so if they can get a turnover too, obviously it's going to vote pretty well for us. What kind of boost do you think Nick Wilson, hey, you know, he's a veteran guy. You know, it's not a whole lot he hadn't seen. I thought all the running backs played well. I thought the, the, the young guys, Brandon Leon and, and uh, Tilford, both ran pretty well as well. So we'll, you know, we'll get more and more confidence than all those young guys. You had talked about using Nick and JJ together, and then you did it on that touchdown to start the second quarter. Did you sort of see the effect that that can have on a defense? Well, yeah, a little bit. I think you know we're trying to get you know mix up our formations a little bit. Obviously today with the lead, in the second half we didn't do as much, but. You know, you want to get your best players on the field as much as you can, and, and those two are pretty good players.